This video is going to introduce Python and also introduce programming as a concept and why you should do it. Writing code is a really good thing to, to learn how to do because it's not just going to help you write programs, not just going to help you with computer science, it's also going to help you problem solve, learn how to concentrate and once you get going you write programs that work, it becomes quite addictive, you want to do more and more with it. And the bottom line is that the last bullet point there, there simply aren't enough people in the world to do it. And there's some really good jobs out there that, that sometimes go unfilled because there aren't enough people with the skills to be able to, to do these things, program program well. So why Python? Um, I, I admit at first, a long time ago, when I first came across Python, I programmed in Visual Basic. And I thought, what what is this? This looks like just like something for schools, really. But it's not. It's more than that. Python is a programming language and it is used throughout the world. It's very, very popular for good reason, I think. It's very popular, particularly in schools and it's in demand. And Google used Python. And here's some list of companies using Python. So it's not just about schools. Um, it is very popular, but it can also teach you so many things about programming, which is why it is popular with schools. We use idle something called idle it's an ide which stands for integrated developer environment and what that is is it's basically where you write your programs idle was named after eric idle of monty python thing fame so we can open idle if you haven't got it you'll need to install it and you can download it you should be able to download it or you can use online editors but let's just have a look at it here this is the command prompt and what we can do is what we've got here is a cursor flashing that's called a command prompt and before we had windows and we had um, all the fancy um, icons and things like that this is how we use computers and using um, a horrible piece of software called WordPerfect everything was on the command prompt there were no you couldn't click on any icons to it. I had to remember all these function keys to be able to use it this is similar to that if I want to do something I need to type an instruction so I can use this as a calculator what is one plus one okay two okay it can tell me that what is two divided by two one point one point zero okay notice that is a whole number there a real not an integer um, if you wanted that to be an integer, you'd need to specify that. Okay, and we can do another one, we can do another calculation. I can do a multiplication there. What's well, 56 times 748? That's my answer, 41,888. So idle can be used as a calculator, the command prompt. But if I want to start writing a program, I need to go to File, New. And I get my window here and I can start writing my program out. So new file and let's look at writing our first program. And the first program you should ever write in any language is hello world. That's the first thing you should ever do. Everyone should do that. I think it's the law to do that. So I'm going to write my first ever program. I'm going to write just to print hello world. So write print. Notice that that turns purple. Hello world, exclamation mark, like that. Okay, nothing happens yet because I need to save it and then I need to run it. Okay, so I'm just going to save it in my user area. I'm just going to save it in documents. Uh, shouldn't really do that. I should save it in a folder, but just for now. Hello world. Okay, save. Now I can run it. Here's the moment of truth. Run module. Hello world. Okay, there's previous programs I've done there. Here's my hello world. It worked. Okay, so hello world worked. So try that out yourself. Write your first program to print out hello world. 